Well, hello everybody and welcome. We've been a month in Bonterra Park. We have, yeah. Mm. We? Mm. Pippin's not been well for the last week. No. She, just, she's right a bit now? mucousy and runny and she's a bit lethargic. And mm. I've got her on chicken and rice, but mm. she she's had a little bit this morning. So, I mean, she's not desperately ill. At times she perks up and she wants to play with the other dogs, but her energy levels are very low. Mm. Um, so I'm thinking I might just take her to the vets. It was a bit better this morning, yeah. I thought. So we'll see what it's like over the next couple of days, mm. and then we'll reassess mm. it maybe on Wednesday. Mm. It's Sunday today. Yeah. Because so. we've had bad stomachs <laughs> since well, we've been here. So it's I'm for just... different reasons, I think. <laughs> no, but I'm just saying, you know. It's it. So, mind you, if I was that worried, I'd just if I was really concerned, I. Like, well, we'd I thought go it was life-threatening. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, we would go. go straight to the vets. Yeah, no worries about that. But we'd drive away to the vets, but so I'm hoping. You, you might, so anyway, you might notice, thank you for your concerns. Yeah, you might thank notice you. down yes. here that there's no silver oh. screen on the van. And we've taken that off because mm. well, we've been a month in and we've not really, from here forwards, mm. we've not really used and we've used it as a bit of a yes, dumping ground we have indeed it's amazing mm. how much <laughs> rubbish and mess you can make in one little area mm. Mm. when you don't yes. really use it and you just throw stuff in there you couldn't even sit on the seats so <laughs> and look, so Wendy's, this, you know what this is this is it's a washing line <laughs> I would, when i take bring the washing in and it's a bit damp i hang it up on this this is it's ridiculous, um, isn't it? And all over the cab, I was hanging it. Old Mother drive. Ducato's Chinese laundry. Yes. <laughs> um, that's what it is down this end. Mm. So Wendy's got up this morning. She's got her cleaning head on. I have know. indeed, yes. And um, what well, we're emptying all these. Take those silver screens off. off. Yeah. Get all this rubbish cleared away. Oh, she's so bossy. I am actually. <laughs> <laughs> because cause we really must do I think the day goes in when you're in I don't know if you find that if you're here in Spain like in your motorhome I don't know where the time goes and the never thing, think you'll be bored oh god no. I don't know what the time is and now and the thing is yeah, because be you know I know I'll go on about the, all the electrics and stuff mm -hmm. um, let's just turn that around a little mm -hmm. bit uh, but we because we've got no 240 volt we're being a bit more careful with what we mm -hmm. use on electric I mean at the moment we've got Pippin's uh, chicken and rice cooking mm. on the gas. So, you know, mm. it was, it's been a month. We switched over the first gas bottle yeah. two days ago. Mm. So that was a, almost a month for one gas bottle. And normally, when we're um, traveling around mostly off grid, mm. it, it, two bottles will last one month. So we've we mm. used half mm. the amount of gas. Um, so, we're going to have to, at some point over the next week or so, drive mm. out and get refilled with gas. I don't want to drive out too soon. No. Because I want to get right down low on the other gas bottle so we can have a good fill yes. up, you know, and rather I, and than I, just pop out for one bottle. I get concerned because the water collects in the wastewater tanks. And, and like, if you put down some oh. hot water and you've got the thing open, it won't come out. It sort of sits somewhere. And I think it's not very nice. I think we're, it's stinky a bit. We're, we're very a, slightly yeah. unlevel. Mm. By by yeah. about yeah. Uh, by about three inches across yeah. the van. So we're That's, not we're not that slopey, but it is a little mm. bit of a slope. So mm. any new water mm. that goes down the sink mm. goes into the waste tank and obviously sits over that side, yeah. where the outlet is over that side. Mm. So I don't know how much here's is a, in there. A, one point to note, and I think, I mm. think I've think i seen it on one van, mm. you should have outlets for your wastewater on both sides of your waste mm. tank. Mm. You really should. There should be an, an opening on both sides, because, mm. you know, mm. um, I've been in some places, in some caravan sites, where I've had to actually drive the wrong way mm. down the one-way system so that I can get the waste drain tap over the drain mm. because it's too far out or too far in or you know mm. it's just it's been a nightmare so if any boat home manufacturers especially auto trail if you're watching this put a waste 
drain on mm. both sides of the van. Make it easier. Mm. Probably add ten quid to the to the cost. Mm. Well, what, great. What, yeah. when I when I finish just cleaning all the cupboards and that, I'll sh uh, all the things in the front. I'll show you what we've got in there, what we've left in there, and I'm then well. that will be <laughs> good. That will be good. Um, <laughs> Because I just want to get on and do that. I feel mu much better once that. It's looking up. pretty tidy, actually. Well, I've been doing it all morning. So, it's getting there. It's getting there. So, I've I'll just. Should we just show them now? Show them now. What's what that looks like? It's a bit dusty, but you won't yes. be able to see it on the yes. camera. Let's take you down there now. You're going to go there to that. See, Here I've done are. my door my side i haven't done started to do so here's the uh mm. this is the dashboard usual driving position when he's not been over this side yet mm. so it's really dirty but over this side look <laughs> I haven't been all I'm all <laughs> nice all nice and neat and tidy over that side and you might think well surely that's the way you keep it all the no. time but no look at, i want to look at this cupboard this is beautiful and tidy. Travel sweets. I think they're very sticky, but we always have those. Um, wet wipes. I always keep those in there. This is what in Spain I miss B and M and home bargains and that because you can't get things like that. Four packets per pound. Um, hand cream. That's lovely. Hand That's fruits. a coconut and vanilla from Wilco. That, oh, I always know when Wendy's using that because I can smell the coconut yeah, it's a nice right one. across it. Yeah, really finished it. Very fragrant and very and nice. What else have we got? Oh, more sweets. These are these are lovely. These are the sugar-free sugar ones. Sugar-free creamy cappuccinos. They're nice. Yeah. But the other ones in the tin, the lemon ones, have got sugar in them. If Steve's weary, he has those. And in here is just an assortment of tablets in case I'm sitting here and I've got a headache or a migraine coming on so or Steve's got a pain in his foot or something so we keep them to hand and that's that so I'm going to put them back tidily and so that's that one and then in this one I've just got these I've, they're okay I use them sometimes just to clean about a bit windoline glass and shiny surfaces yeah, they're useful to keep in the cab. Um, some pens. You must think I'm mad. There's, and I've got a whole box of books. These, these are cleaning wipes. There's some tissues. And in here, oh, I haven't done this one yet. We've got walking the dog. Because I always think, oh, when we're in the motorway, um, we want somewhere to stop. It just shows you the places you can pull over, not far from the motorway exits, and walk the dog and have something to eat. So it's only in the UK, that one. So that's that book. Oh, and then we've got, oh, these are all the bits for the gasset. The gas for that? Yeah. yeah. You might get those out, shall we? Yeah, I'll show you them, because you need them. That one, is there any more? No, that's all. So there's that one, that one, and that one. So wherever we are, we can fill up with our gas. So they're kept in there. So these things, mm. uh, they, they've all got the same threaded end on and they screw into the gasset adapter on the side of the van and then you just use whichever one. Um, mm. I think it's, it's that one for Spain. That one we used up in the Netherlands and we haven't used that one yet. I think that might be for, well that's, that's for um, mm. Spain and France, that one. And then this one might be for Germany, I don't know. Hello, Princess. So I'll just put them back in there. And, uh... Pause it for a minute. So it rambles, well, you've got... It rambles so. on a bit, I haven't quite... <laughs> what else have I always going to say? I'll clean it out a bit. But we always keep all the... Until I... Till we log them, we keep the um, receipts in there for the petrol and the auto gas. Yeah. yeah. And that, I don't know what that is. That's a little gas banner that comes Deep with the gasset system. Oh, right. So that's that. Oh, and a torch. I don't know if that even yeah. works. 
a torch that works. There you go. Yeah. Well, we're not uh, finished all. <laughs> so that's what we're up to this very hot Sunday, and it's Sunday lunchtime. I wish we were having a nice roast dinner. You can I go for a nice those. roast dinner at Sam's, mm. but we, you know, it's a big no. walk up there. Anyway, and I think you need to book well mm. before. Anyway. That's it yes. for today. If you've enjoyed our little ramblings and uh, <laughs> you'd like to give us a thumbs up, please do. Mm. We like getting those. And if you want to continue following our adventures as we travel around the UK and Europe, mm. please subscribe. Just click that subscribe button. Do it now. Mm. And if you don't want to miss any of our content, click the bell icon mm. and we'll send you a reminder yes, when we, we upload. Mm. And, um, thanks so much for watching mm, thank you for all your comments and your, comments. And your advice yes. and we're going to see you again soon yeah bye bye for bye now bye bye everyone